Hi, in this slide I want to talk about service quirks for, for customers that have estimators. Um, so these would be customers where uh, they're big commercial uh, prevention maintenance kind of jobs and they're trying to get a quote into some plant to go do a big job there. They could be a subcontractor putting in bids for construction projects, particularly on a critical path, so that the faster they can get their bid in, the greater the odds are that they might actually get the contract. Um, I remember reading a particular case study about a commercial overhead door company where often it was kind of an oversight. They're building a building and they go, oh my gosh, we need all these garage doors and based on how things are going, we have to fit them to certain specifications at the last minute. So it was something that they sort of put off to order the last minute, but without snapping it on. So it's an overlooked need to add it on right away to be complete. So they competed on speed and, and, and won enormously. I had a, a very fascinating personal experience with a big four color print printer in Louisville, Kentucky back in 1976, uh, where we basically hotwired the ability to give these people a quick response time and, and, and benefited normally, enormously. So the goal in these places is to try to get a little bit of a team to team thing you bring in all the people relevant on your side spend uh, you know an hour or two uh, with the estimator sort of saying let's flow chart the stage as a chronological stage as you go through and where's the most downtime how can we squeeze that out so everybody's being productive every minute and you're not sitting hanging waiting for us to get back to you and at our end how do we hotwire what we do internally how do we even go to some of our factories that we use on a regular basis and and get them to you know give us a little bit of a break or figure out how to end run hot wire their response time uh, and come up with a big hairy audacious goal of trying to reduce the total time from here's a bid and get the bid back to the customer by as much as 80 percent if you choose to do it because the job is big and you think speed might help and win and so uh, we did that markedly uh, with this particular printer uh, and as a result we didn't just get a much bigger share of their traditional business. They actually, going forward, were winning lots of new business because they were competing. They were they were getting their bids back so quickly, and they were credible, and they'd done business with these people before. So you know, from the final customer's viewpoints, like get three bids. Well, we got the bid back from ABC. You know graphics and, and we've used them before and we haven't heard of these, well, just give it to them. So they were getting more wins and we were getting that business. So that was the case where our business actually went up 500% in one year's time. Half of we stole from competition, probably the other half we got from, from um, existing business. So those that's a, that's a quirk if you happen to have a segment of customer where they're actually doing uh, uh, estimation jobs to, to win uh, business that consumes the products you sell. Thank you.